Hello everyone, welcome to a new episode of Let's Play Art of Rally. So let us continue the current season. We have uh, stage 4 and stage 5 left to complete in this current rally. And I would like to get to that in as soon as possible. So we'll be playing in Franzenheim. Let us have fun. Denk to. Gorgeous location. God damn it, I, I'm already detesting the rally route. Like, look how zigzaggy the road is. I don't like that at all. Let's begin. <coughs> We're heading out, baby. So, despite the road being as exactly as it is, we'll we'll try to make pro uh, progress as swiftly as possible. Uh, I don't know which which time of the day we're playing as in game, but I guess it would be around noon, given from the position of the sun. That's my expectation, at least. Accelerate. And let's move on. No, 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 don't. Oh my god, are you kidding me? That really sucked. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? That's so bullshit, like it's so easy to lose control of this car, you have to control it at the millimeter to be sure that you don't, uh, the car won't tumble over the fucking road. Yeah, I'm already hating the, the rally track, but I'm just... Uh, trying to enjoy the scenery because that's kind of the entire purpose of this game is to enjoy the scenery of the levels and the scenery is indeed very gorgeous like that's just a given for this game every single level is gorgeous to look at So we align ourselves with the road track. Okay, now we can finally accelerate a little bit. Although, soon enough we get to a curve in which we'll, we have to decelerate to be sure that we don't stumble over. Oh god, I can already see the track ahead. It's so goddamn zigzag again. Fucking Christ. Why does it have to be like this? Oh god. We're almost at the end, come on. There's not that much left to go through. Here is the end, baby. Okay, which place are we on? God damn it, we're on 8th place, are you kidding me? Somebody finished in 3 minutes and 7 seconds, Jean Claude. How is that possible? How did they do it? What kind of car did they use? 
Okay, so we were playing during morning and now we will be playing during sunset. I get it. Mertesdorf. Is that how, how you pronounce it? Alright. Pretty sure it is. Let's get a quick glimpse of the rally track. Breaking out, huh? Okay, let's begin. Let's repair our car first, and now let's begin the stage. This will be the final race in the rally, so this is my last chance to get a better score for this entire rally. I really have to do incredibly well this time around to be able to uh, have a total sc uh, final score that's actually commendable. Because right now we've been, I think we've been consistently after 5th place in each of our uh, races in this particular rally. And this puts us in a, almost a, near, close to the last place. And I'm not particularly happy about that. But especially last uh, rally race we, we ended up on 8th uh, place and that's just absolutely fucking terrible. Just absolutely fucking terrible. I don't know how the AI does it, but it's really consistently very good at this game. I guess me having to having to do two recoveries for my car was part of the issue, but still that's insanely terrible. So this race I'm planning on trying to recover some of the score, although as you can see I'm not doing that well on that front. I'm doing the best I can, but yeah, it's it's still a terrible fucking situation for, for myself. Come on. bit to the left now let's just constantly accelerate over here this is quite fine Okay, so this road isn't as zigzag as the previous one, so maybe I'll, I'll get a better time. We'll see. There's a nice lake to our left. And now we can just constantly accelerate. There's a curve over here that's in a wide arc though. Now let's veer to our left. Now let's just power through this the rest of this racetrack. Get out of my way, people. Why are you in the middle of the road in a fucking rally race? That makes zero sense. More German tanks for whatever reason. God damn, the lighting is awesome on this side of the level. Like when the sun is up front above you, above the, the horizon in a sunset, it just looks marvelous. Oh, god damn it. Come on, accelerate. Just like that. Good. These fucking... what the fuck are they even called? These rocks at the sides of the road are seriously annoying. Come 
Come on, you're almost at the end. You're almost at the fucking end. Not that much left, baby. Not that much left. Just accelerate your heart's content. Content. Okay, not even four and a half minutes. And this time we scored pretty well. We are on third place. Although someone using the same car scored on the second place. They were nine seconds faster than us. Which is quite impressive. Well done, Morricon. Okay. So this was the end of, of our current rally. So we scored on third place on this group, which is not a great, but you know, it is, it is what it is. Restarts left 100%. Okay, that's cool. And now we are in 1976 Norway. Ah, this is the second rally race. Rally 2 out of 2. Okay, I see now. So the first rally was in Germany and the second rally is in Norway. Oh, we finally get to see ice and snow. That's so awesome. Man, I've been waiting for this for such a long time. Like, this looks awesome. Like, the low poly design really shines through in this arctic environment. Look at this, it's so gorgeous. I've been waiting for, an, for some nice scenery in an arctic region, or at least in a temperate region, but during winter for such a long time. This is awesome. Look at the pine trees. Ah, it's so wonderful. Okay, let's start. Actually, this is where we'll be leaving off for next time. So thank you very much for watching. See you next time.